What's up guys it's the real deal welcome back to the channel guys check it out the wifey has done good um she got me this for christmas and yeah i don't know what do you guys think do you want the merch do you like the merch um you know i could do hoodies t-shirts pint glasses mugs all that good stuff if you want the merch let me know in the comments below so um yeah so We've had Christmas and now Polarium. We're moving on to New Year's and Polarium are giving us a two-time chance to get a mythical champion from Primal Shards. Uh, so 2% chance of a legendary, which is nice, and a 1% chance to get that mythical. We got 27 of these bad boys. Someone in my clan, he had 60 Primal Shards. He got three mythical champions. So hopefully we get a little bit of that luck as well. Um, so my most wanted champion has to be the Night Queen, Chrysia. Um, She just looks like an absolute beast for Arena. Love Arena. I don't have Yumiko. I don't have Warlord. And I don't have Prince Kaimar. And she does all three into one. So on her A3 in her normal form, um, she can basically strip and put skills on cooldown, just like Yumiko and Warlord. And then if we switch it up, and then on the A3, she can remove debuffs. So she cleanses and she's going to, um, you know, reduce cooldowns on our champions as well. What an absolute beast. Um, who else would I really want? I think the other champion that I'd really like as well has to be uh, Lazarus. Just like, hits like an absolute truck. I mean, man. Is he ugly? But um, yeah, but he just absolutely slams. Just an like just one of the best damage dealers in the game right now. He'd be pretty cool to have as well, to play around with as well. So I think that's my most two wanted mythical champions. Let me know, you know, who the mythical champions you guys are after. Who would be your number one? And for some reason, come on, it's not letting me come out the index. There we go. All right. Let's go for it, guys. Um, yeah, let's just go straight for a temple, see what happens. Okay, a lot of rares. Oh, this is painful. Uh, Bushy, Bloodfeather. Oh, Kanochi. Okay, Blood Bloodfeather is actually a decent champion. She hits pretty hard. Uh, I just want to switch up a bit. I'm just going to do a quick... 10 pull on the old ancients just mix up a little bit see if that helps at all apothecary double apothecary great great champion definitely someone that people should try and get their hands on uh, great for progression in the early game come on guys where's that mythical all right Oh, no. Okay, so that's 20 primals and nothing yet. Um, This, yes, Sarak, sorry, <laughs> Sakira, um, she's pretty decent, um, hits pretty hard. The other champions are like kind of new-ish, some of them quite new. Not used any of them personally, um, but... Yeah, I don't think there's anyone particularly great out there. So seven, seven primals to go. Oh, it's not looking good, boys. I mean, not even a legendary. Nothing but res. Wow. It's so true what people say. Primals are just ancients. Wow. All right, two left. No way. All right. One shard and a dream. Come on, boys. Oh, my God. You're breaking my balls. You are breaking my balls. Wow, nothing but trash. 
Uh, well, obviously not. No, no, no. Not like obviously Vogoff, a great champion. You can use him for Bobble. So much content to be honest. He's an amazing healer. Um, sort of falling off for Arena, but still pretty decent. Um, but yeah, but like for my account, I've pulled nothing that's going to help me progress. Nothing but trash for me. What a shame. Wow. Well, guys, I hope you have better luck than me. Fingers crossed you all get a mythical champion that you're after. I've been The Real Deal. Make sure to smash, smash, smash that subscribe. Leave me a cheeky thumbs up. And I'll see you all in the video soon. Peace.